Okay, this is a, a video about um, doing pre-processing on our CDs. Um, th these are a few steps that you can do to really help us um, get these CDs out quickly to our patrons. Um, there are just a few things that need to be done with with the CDs um, when they're um, just we just got them basically. Um, if if they're coming in shrink wrap like this. And let me note, this is only for music CDs, only for music CDs. Um, we do different things for the other kinds, so if you're doing this, you just want to stick to the music CDs. Um, so if you've got one here that's coming in shrink wrap like this, you want to remove the shrink wrap, which you can do with a, with, a, with scissors, um, paper clip, or with like one of these special things for that. Get all the packaging off. Okay. So there's just a few um, things we're going to put on. Um, first, we're going to get the art out, um, and we're going to get one of these Do Not Return in Book Drop stickers. And we're going to put it in the front somewhere that where it's clear, not here, anywhere else in the front, but not in this corner here. Um, and somewhere it's not blocking too much of the art. So just like this is fine. Um, then we've got a pie chart sticker. These are optional. If it's not going to work with um, with uh, the art, you can leave these out. But um, just find a spot for this um, inside like this somewhere where it's not blocking too much of the art. And now you can put the put the the um, front art back in the back in the thing there. Now um, you want to use a, a marker, like a black or a silver sharpie, depending on the color of the the art on the disc. So you just and, and you only want to write on the side of the disc that's got the art on it. If it's if you see something like this, do not write on it. Um, only write on something that's already got got writing. Um, and only write on the, the writing side, not the data side. So, just want to write A C P L and Laramie W Y somewhere. Depends on where you've got space to do that. So that's a little rough, but that's okay. So ACPL um, Laramie WY there. Okay. Then you know you want to pop out that that little um, thing that this goes into, and then you can get to the art on the back. Um, and you want to find a spot for one of these barcodes to go on to. And if there's no other, you know, particular spot for it to go, it can go like just like this here. However, if there's an existing barcode here, it's a good thing to cover that. So we're just going to cover this existing barcode here. You know, just a commercial barcode. We're covering it up with one of our library barcodes there. Okay, now now this um, the art and the um, little jewel case part can go back in. Just want to pop this and pop it back into place there.
And you know you've got the, the do not return a book drop sticker, you've got the pie chart, you've got your writing, ACPL Laramie WY, and you've got the barcode on the back, right there actually. Um, and that's that's it. So this one is is done here. So it's basically the same thing if you've got these these paper cases that aren't um, like the plastic kind. Um, basically the same process, just a little slightly different here. So we're getting the Do Not Return a Book Drop sticker. Putting it on the front here. Open this up here. This is probably the best spot for the pipe drop. Putting a pie chart in there. Okay, in this case, it's probably going to be better to use the silver marker here.